Ciao, I'm Claudio Marcantonini. I'm the deputy director of the climate unit at the Florence School of Regulation. On the 10th of June, the European Commission presented a proposal for the ratification of the Paris Agreement for the European Union. The Commission hopes that this ratification is done quickly because it wants that the Paris Agreement enters into force as soon as possible. This gives us the opportunity to talk about the EU and the Paris Agreement. In these four weeks, we will look at the uh, Paris Agreement, uh, at the main implication of this important treaty. Uh, we will also talk about what the EU intends to do in order to fulfill the Paris Agreement. And uh, we will talk about the importance of international carbon price. But before this, in our first topic, we will look at the implication for climate policy of the most important event that happens in Europe probably in decades, Brexit, or in other words, the exit of the UK from the European Union. What are the pros and cons of the Paris Agreement? How the EU intends to move forward in the climate policy and uh, what are the Brexit implications for the EU and the British climate policy? To explore this question, stay tuned on the FSR website and follow us on the social media.